All right, in today's video, we're gonna talk about the best email marketing platforms or tools that you can use for your small business. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Michael Tanage. For over a decade, I built a seven-figure marketing agency, and now I am buying businesses and scaling them with my marketing strategies, and I'm giving you those marketing strategies away for free through my YouTube channel and through my free weekly newsletter, link in the description below. Okay, let's talk about the best email marketing software or email marketing platforms to use for your small business. Now, there are a ton of email platforms out there, so it can get really difficult to decide which one is best for your business. And through my agency and through the businesses that I own, we've used a bunch of different email marketing platforms. And it really comes down to the fact of what you're trying to accomplish with that email platform. Are you trying to collect leads and put them through a funnel? Are you just trying to send out emails to your customers and you don't really have that big of a budget? Are you trying to build out an entire email newsletter that goes out and you have memberships and all those type things? It really breaks down to what you're trying to do with your email marketing and then finding the best platform or software that works best with that. All right, that being said, I'm gonna break down a couple email marketing platforms and softwares that you can use and their strengths and weaknesses as it relates to the things that you're trying to accomplish. All right, so for the very first one, we're gonna go over MailChimp. MailChimp is a fantastic platform if you're just starting out and you're looking to just get into email marketing and you maybe have a couple emails but you don't have a ton of stuff and you're not looking to do a ton of automation and all those type of things. You just want a place to occasionally email your list and send them information about your business. The thing I really like about MailChimp is their cost. It's very easy to get into this platform and not spend a ton of money every single month and you're able to easily start emailing your email list. What I don't like about MailChimp is when you wanna start getting into database management with your email platform. And what I mean by that is let's say you have a form on your website and you want that form to be on a specific landing page and when people fill out that form, they get tagged with a specific tag. You could do that with just one form, but if you wanted to make another form on a different landing page and tag them with a different tag, that way you know which form they came off of, MailChimp makes that extremely difficult to do. It's also very difficult to stylize and change those forms. So as an entry level email platform or email software, it's a great platform to get into and just start emailing your list. But if you're looking to do more detailed things like really tagging people, sending them through different funnels, all those type things, it's not really the platform to go with. Now there are other platforms that kind of fit into this MailChimp category. I would say platforms like Constant Contact or Klaviyo are similar to that. Where it's a great entry type email platform where you can just really email your list. But when you want to start getting into database management, it's really not that great of a platform. So like I said, MailChimp, Constant Contact, Klaviyo, they're really just good entry level email platforms or email software. Okay, so this is a great entry level type email platforms, but let's say you're a medium to large type business and you really wanna get into database management. So that means being able to tag people a specific way, having multiple forms that tag people, having different funnels, having different automations, even integrating in things like text messaging. The platform that I suggest for that is called ActiveCampaign. Now, the reason I really like ActiveCampaign, and this is actually the email platform that I use for my email newsletter, if you'd like to sign up for that, click the link in the description below. And it's also the email platform that I use across all my businesses and all my client businesses. The reason is, is that they have great customer service. You're very easily able to get a hold of someone, especially just through their chat messaging, and they're able to really give you good answers. They integrate in with a lot of different platforms. They also do really cool things like, let's say for example, you own a Shopify store. You're able to integrate in active campaign into your Shopify store. And if someone has already given you their email address and they've clicked on a specific page in that Shopify store, you can send them an email about that specific product. The only thing that's hard about active campaign is it can get on the pricier side. However, when you start to build out your email list, let's say you have about 3000 people on your email list, in comparison between MailChimp and Active Campaign, Active Campaign is actually comparable with the pricing. It's just as you start getting bigger, it gets a little bit more expensive. So if you have the budget right off the bat, I would just skip the MailChimp platforms and I would just go right to the Active Campaign. And then you're able to have a really robust database and be able to tag everyone the way you want to, put them in the automations, integrate it into your website. In my opinion, it's a really robust platform and is really good when it comes to email marketing. Now, because I use ActiveCampaign with my email newsletter and across all my clients and my businesses, 
I built out an entire mini course on exactly how to build out your active campaign account. It's completely free. Click the link in the description below if you'd like to get access to that. But that mini course gives you step-by-step -step instruction on how to set up your active campaign account. Okay, so, so far we've already talked about if you're starting out with a small budget using an email platform or software like MailChimp or Constant Contact, if you have more of a budget and you're ready to start building out your email database, use an email platform or software like ActiveCampaign. But let's say your business requires things behind a paywall. So for example, let's say you sell courses or you have exclusive content that you wanna to give to your email list. There are a couple platforms that you can utilize that have email marketing integrated into them and a private membership that you can charge people for. Now, the two platforms that I would suggest utilizing for that are Kajabi and Kartra. Unlike ActiveCampaign, where it is specifically an email marketing platform, these platforms are really more of a membership type platform. So you're able to have private content and charge people to get access to that. So they get login details and all that kind of stuff. But integrated in with that is their own email marketing software. So if you're the type of business that has that or you're thinking about doing that, I would definitely check out Kartra or Kajabi. Now between the two, they both have landing page builders and form builders and ability to tag people and automation. So they're really robust platforms. The only cons that I don't really like too much about these is that if you are just looking for an email platform for your business and you aren't worried about the memberships or any of those type of things, I wouldn't go with these platforms. The other thing you have to watch is I've had issues with platforms like Kartra where we're going and sending an email out to almost 100,000 plus people and the email only gets sent out to about 2,000 people. So they've definitely had sending issues in the past that I've caught across some of my clients. So you need to watch that when utilizing one of these email platforms. But, and I think that comes down to the fact that they're trying to be a, really a jack of all trades where they have websites and landing pages and email marketing and a membership area. And so because you're a jack of all trades, you're a master of none. And so if you're really looking for a really good email marketing platform, like I said, active campaign is great. If you're looking for something that you can have a membership that's private and you can charge people for it, try Kartra or Kajabi. All right, so let's say you're trying to build out a business where it's specifically just about the email newsletter. You have a paid version of your email newsletter and people pay you monthly to get access to that. You easily are able to integrate in sponsors. You're able to pay to sponsor other email newsletters very easily. There are platforms like Beehive that allow you to really start to build out an email newsletter business. Now, this platform is a little less known because there aren't many people building out email newsletter businesses. And really, if you have a small business and you're trying to grow your email list and, and have automations and stuff, like I said, Active Campaigns is the top email platform that I would suggest. However, this platform is great if you are building an email newsletter business because it easily integrates in a paid newsletter feature. You're able to easily integrate in sponsors and you're able to easily pay to be on other people's emails. Now, you may be asking yourself, well, Michael, you have an email newsletter. Why aren't you on Beehive and you're using ActiveCampaign instead? So when I was picking the email platform that would be best for my email newsletter, the reason I went with ActiveCampaign over something like Beehive was I always found that when the platform sends out my emails, the open rates were better on ActiveCampaign. So what that basically means is the system that sends out the emails for ActiveCampaign versus sending out the emails for Beehive has a better chance of getting the people's inboxes and being open. The other piece too for me was the fact that I wanted to be able to expand my business if I needed to, and I can easily do that with ActiveCampaign. With Beehive, I was basically stuck within the box of only having an email newsletter business, and I didn't want to stick myself just in that box. But I do have to say, some of the features of Beehive like getting sponsors for your email list very easily and it just immediately integrates into your email list. You don't have to go find sponsors. You don't have to put in the graphics yourself. Any of those type things is very intriguing. All right, so to recap, if you are a small business and you are low on budget, go with something like MailChimp or Constant Contact. If you're a small business or medium size or large size and you're looking to really build out your database and get a lot of information about your customers and you have a little bit more budget, go with ActiveCampaign. If you have a membership or you're selling courses or something like that, go with Kartra or Kajabi. And if you have an email newsletter and the only business is just that email newsletter, so you bring in money through sponsors or you bring in money by having a paid version of your newsletter, go with an email platform or email software like Beehive. And like I mentioned in the middle of the video, if you wanna get information on how to build out active campaign, I have a free mini course in the description below. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video. You can check out my last one here. And if not, I'll see you in the next one.